Good afternoon. Welcome, Wombats. This is a the first video devlog we have for you guys. Uh, my name is Matt, and I'm the artist on Puzzle Puppets. And so right now we're going to go jump into the game and show you a little bit about it. Uh, a few of the basic gameplay mechanics and um, what stuff we've been working on. But first, let's jump into the dressing room, because that's honestly the most fun you can have with a game. Uh, so I'm going to go dress my little puppet up right now. I'm going to dress him up as an orc type dude, but he's going to be sophisticated orc, because he is cool like that. So we're going to add some uh, color to some of these costume items. There we go, that should be alright. Uh, now we're going to change his body color so he looks more orcish. Yeah, some ugly green sounds good. There we go. And we'll change his teeth. There we go, that's that's what we want. Lovely. And we'll choose a, a nice weapon for him. Yeah, let's go with a big wooden sword. Lovely. So let's jump straight into the game. Um, uh, so what you do is you choose any play you like. We'll have various different ones um, once we actually release the game. Uh, for now, we'll show you the Ogre Wedding. This is one of the first ones with the um, our first cutscene. So you can have a look at that in a second. So we have a little princess. She's sleeping in bed. And the uh, door creaks open. And she's a little bit startled. And then, oh no, it's the Ogre! And then she starts running around the bedroom screaming. We've got to add a few more sound effects and everything. And then she gets knocked out unconscious and wakes up at the wedding and he's got to be doing little kissy sounds something silly, something stupid to make the uh, the act and play have a, some sort of meaning and excitement to it so uh, it comes to the uh, the map screen right now and the idea is you travel along this path um, killing monsters uh, to then save the princess from the ogre groom so let's jump into it and show you how the gameplay works so you fight monsters along each path, and um, what you do is you pop colored blocks to do attacks on the monster, and um, it lowers their health uh, until you can defeat them and move on to the next monster. Like that. And um, the more blocks you pop, um, the harder the, the hits are, and the more points you get, and um, you can get combos and all this other stuff. You know, fun score systems and everything and oh I'm going to about to die soon so use the um, the purple blocks to uh, block incoming attacks and you, if you time it right you can um, block it otherwise um, you get hit so I'm going to keep killing this dude and um, you have XP uh, every time you hit monsters with blocks you um, damage them and you get score and um, XP and then you can level up and you get more score um, every time oh that was close Sorry, half concentrating, half killing. I'm about one hit away from dying. It's never a good thing. Oh, oh that was close. So the, the gameplay becomes a bit more fun when um, you're on low life and you're trying to defeat the monsters. Uh oh, here we go. And so we have all sorts of various different monsters for you to uh, destroy. Um, there we go, I leveled up. I've got a lot more health now. All is well. We'll have like assassins that have fast attacks but don't have much damage, um, don't have much health. Uh, then we'll have big orcs who are slow, and but they hit really hard, so we'll give the gameplay a bit more of a mix-up. So I've just got one more monster to kill here to finish this um, chain of nodes. There we go. Hooray! And you get it more XP, you get a bonus multiplier, so it gives that, gives that a little bit extra for trying to you know, add more difficulty to it. Um, but it'll take me quite a while to finish that one because we have all sorts of different plays with various different lengths. So this Gladiator one is a nice short one. Four acts in it uh, with one monster per each, per act. So I'll quickly show you what happens when we finish an act. Um, I'm going to try and get a big score in this so I can try and get three stars to impress you all. But knowing my luck, it will not work. So I'll choose green as the color I want to get together. So the idea is right now I'm just trying to get a massive combo um, of colored blocks so that when I hit him on the last hit, uh, it'll just give me heaps and heaps of score. Uh, oh no, it's not attached. Oh no, this is all going horribly wrong. It's alright, I can do it. I totally can't do it. This is not happening. Ah, oh, how upsetting. But, I finished the act, 
And I've got my score and you get stars awarded to you, sort of like, you know, Angry Birds and you cut the rope, um, was it? You know, all, all those other sort of fun little games. But two stars, that's alright, that's alright. I'm sure you guys can do better. So the last last thing I'll show you is the, the new shop that we've added. So um, every time you're killing monsters, you get um, like little money, and you can use this money to buy all sorts of different items in the shop. So be it such as new bodies, I can buy a ghost body, um, different sets of eyes, haircuts, small accessories for your character, so you can buy cool sunglasses, and um, that's where you can go back to the dressing room and add those sunglasses. So there we go. Yeah, lovely. Well, we might leave it as that. Um, we'll try and give some more video updates uh, next week as well, so you can see the new new updates, uh, what, we, what we're working on. Um, but otherwise, thank you for watching. Please do follow us on Twitter and Facebook. Uh, we appreciate any sort of uh, feedback you give us, um, or just tell us you know you like how the game's going. But yes, thank you for watching. Catch you next week.